Hey guys, Ryan Jensen, Bob Hurley RV. Today we're looking at the 2023 Fleetwood Bounder 33C here at Bob Hurley RV. This is a floor plan they've had for a while, and you know what? They're like, hey, we're not going to change anything. Everybody likes this floor plan. They've made some small adjustments down the line, but we really like this Bounder product. Let's get into it. Let me show you a few things here. Number one, you got a nice big open floor plan here in the in the front. Again, this is a 33 footer, so it's it's a not one of your big uh, Class A motorhomes, but a little easier to drive, a little less space going down the road. Uh, let's start here in the kitchen. I'll show you a few things. Number one, some pretty good storage. You do have full pull-out drawers there, fully accessible. They go all the way out. Notice you do have metal gliders and plywood on the sides. Uh, nice solid surface countertops, double sink, uh, upgraded sink fixture. Uh, you do have a, looks like a convection microwave on board with a generic Dometic oven there, three burner stove top. Some of the, some of the basic things we've seen on motorhomes in the past. Uh, one of the upgrades or see here is the nicer refrigerator. Uh, man, I like the uh, I like the inverter-based residential refrigerators because they're bigger. They cool a lot quicker. You know, a lot of these old refrigerators can take uh, hours and hours to cool, and this will take about an hour to cool down completely. So, uh, very cool feature. Runs off an inter inverter and generator. Um, over there to your right, you do have a nice big booth dinette. You can kind of see on one cushion there those those, those both lay down flat. That's one of the easier uh, beds to make in a motorhome. We got our little window flap down there to kind of give you an idea of what that looks like. And then uh, I really like this nice big theater seat set up here. Those are just beautiful, man. They look good, they're big. I'm sure you got a little bit of storage in here. Look at all that storage in there, that's pretty cool. I don't know, you know what you would put in there, maybe a stack of DVDs or something if you still use DVDs, but uh, that's pretty cool. And then uh, those don't come down, but you do have direct access over there to your TV and your fireplace. So great floor plan, man. This is very similar to their 35K floor plan. Just a little bit shorter, a little less money, uh, a little easier to go down the road. Your bathroom is actually central on this unit, so it's right here. There's your uh, shower as you're walking in. This actually, I'm going to step in here and do this. This actually is a three glass system. I like the three sliding doors because notice it makes this entrance a lot bigger. So it's a pretty tight shower, but it is rectangular, so I like that. Pretty easy to still get in and out of here. You know, I'm I'm 5'11", and this is about probably 6'4", so pretty easy to get in and out of there still. Nice little countertop space. Again, there's your central bathroom right there. Uh, nice little uh, storage area right there, lamp area, you know, extra additional storage top. And then walking into the bedroom here, what a lot of people like about this floor plan is it is a king bed setup. So you do have the nice big wide king as you walk in there, which I love makes this bedroom a little bit bigger. You do have a TV. You do have a storage on both sides there. Kind of check that out. This is, uh, this is different, but that's all storage in there. If you can get around there, sorry, I'm moving quick. And then storage in there as well. So they do really give you a lot of storage back here for a smaller motor home. And then here is additional storage there. I don't think that's a washer dryer prep, so keep that in mind, but it is nice and big and open uh, for additional storage there. And then uh, you've got obviously some additional dresser space down here as well in this floor plan. So, all right, let's check the chassis out. Before we do that, notice you do have some additional storage here. I forgot to hit on this, but I love these. These are actually pull out pantry doors on top and then additional storage below. Great pantry storage for the kitchen. Moving into the chassis area, uh, man, I love the new Ford upgrade they've got. This is the V8 Ford 7.3 engine. Um, these things have more torque, more suspension, better drive, quicker or more tight drive, which I really like. All your dials are on the steering wheel. One thing Fleetwood has gone to is they put their radio station right up here in the middle, and then they have put their uh, their backup camera and side camera right there. So I love that. This this right here is a life changer. It's very easy and convenient to see what you're going into. I love that. Um, generator on board, obviously, three cup holders. Ford is always really good about storage and places to put stuff, phones, cup holders, keys, wallets, etc. Cup holder on both sides there, that's a win. You do have a nice uh, lounge recliner there in your passenger seat. That whole, uh, you know, the whole, in fact, I'll demo this real quick since we're doing that. This whole thing comes up there, additional, you know, uh, uh, food or, you know, Atlas, if people still do that, you can do that as well. Again, we're in the 2023 Fleetwood Bounder 33C. Come check it out today at Bob Hurley RV.